hello to Levi. He's my lap puppy. We can take a break from authenticating in order to play with puppies. Levi, look at this little baby. You look so much bigger on camera. The camera puts on like 10 pounds on you. Huh. We need to get some Levi's in the chat. Oh, good boy. Let me see, you want your toy? Here. Here. Oh. Like this? Levi. You just chilling? Want your toy? Want your toy? No? I mean, he <laughs> Benny's in the chat. He's welcome to get down. He's, uh, I guess he's just going to chill. You want to just sit? You want to work on some OAuth? Okay, Levi, I need you to teach me how to actually do HTTP posts here properly. What do you think? You want to lick my glass? Mmm. Alright, why are we not getting here? HTTP get, authenticate. Is that showing up properly in our little swagger? Sign in, authenticate. Sign in, authenticate. What am I missing? It's also, it, it's not actually posting back the right things. Hmm. Hi. Hi, little bubba. Oh, uh, Levi. You gonna help me write code, or are you just gonna be cute? Okay. Yeah, why isn't this? It's not even posting up. Um. You know what we can do? We can set up the redirect endpoint. We can have it post back just like we were, but then have a different endpoint for handling the redirect. Right, so if we post here, then, hmm, buddy, you're falling. You're slipping, there you go. A little lap dog. Okay. I need to take the post body and actually authenticate the user, but then still redirect them back. Can I do that from the client side maybe? Like if I just return Hi bud. If I just return view with this same model, but with a redirect. Hmm. Maybe I don't need all this stuff. Maybe it should just be running from the same endpoint and do a get back to itself. Hey, Bubba. Can I do, can I technically do this? Like, will it will it know which one to route it to based off of what was passed up? Hi, right, baby. You're so sweet. You're killing me. You are so sweet. Look at you. He's just staring at me with such cute little eyes. Here, you want to treat? Ooh. Ooh. Um, 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 um. Okay, let's try that. Let's try with just like to see if if uh, ASP.NET Core will be cool with it. <laughs> I 
ambiguous match. Okay, that makes sense. How can I allow both? How can I allow both? What am I? What am I just missing here? I feel like an idiot. This should definitely be post. Like we should be posting that form data up. And then on success, we should return a view with a redirect. And we're gonna let that view do the redirect instead. So <clears throat> we'll have a new, I guess we can just straight up get rid of this. We're good to go. Um, oh, I'm running, I can't remove it. Get rid of this stupid sample views project. Be gone. Okay, we want a view, new view. And we'll call this sign in redirect. Um, and we'll just have it empty now, but we do want to return it with a state and code. Te can we technically use a tuple here? What are you doing? What are you doing? Is that more comfy? You want the armrest? Hmm? I don't think I've ever had a foster puppy that's just so willing to just sit here on my lap. Like he's just chilling with his head on an armrest. Hold on. We tilt this down. We got to get more puppy in the view. Oh, yeah. He's literally just a lap dog. He's like a little lap blanket while I code. Uh-oh. <laughs> Someone's here.